Commander's Log, Episode 17, Elite Dangerous. Last time, we took a travel. We did. We'll talk about that a little bit later. Hello? And hello? Yes, but we made it. We made it just in the nick of time. Actually, as soon as I hit stop recording, crashed. <laughs> uh, the servers went down. So that was uh, pretty awesome that we, we made it here in time. Uh, but we are now in Ridley Scott. Ridley? Ridley Scott? We can hit refuel all. Probably will do that. Why not? Uh, it just takes, uh, as you guys probably saw, actually I cut a lot of that out. Uh, it takes a long time with the, the fuel scoop that I bought. But we have the, the Tauri chimes. These are the ones I bought. They're worth 16000 I can sell those bad boys. I'm going to do that now. Okay. Yeah, we did good on that. Made quite a bit. And then we have the tea. So we bought those for like a thousand, and we can sell the one for sixteen thousand. Wasn't a great haul, not yet. But the return trip is the one that you make money on. Uh, let's go. Ooh, let's see. Let's not do that right now. We're gonna go to the, the outfitting. Hopefully, yes, we can do that right now. I wanted to try, maybe get rid of the shields. Mmm, I'm scared to do that. We can. We can also do. You know, this says a one and it's available for two. We could upgrade some of these. I don't particularly want to be in this ship for a very long time. I like it, don't get me wrong, but uh, I want to kind of upgrade it. And there's there's the different ones. So there's the, the Sidewinder. How do you how do you do the other ones? I thought it's just left and right. Nope. Oh, right here. Okay. There's a Type 6 Transporter. That's a million. That's kind of... I'd like to get to that one. Ooh, the Anaconda. Yeah, <laughs> no. Actually, the developers, when I first started playing this, they offered me credits for any ship I wanted in the game. I thought that was kind of weird, and I didn't take any of it, because um, obviously I'm not going to get myself by buying a giant ship, and I have no idea. I'd rather work my way up to it. So I could get the hauler, too. Uh, the hauler does not have... it. The adder is kind of like a hauler, in a way. And then the Type 7 transport. So then there's the ASP. Federal dropship. Really? Whoa. <laughs> That's cool. So the kind of kind of the next I kind of want two different ones, uh, the Type 6 transporter and the the Viper. That's kind of where I want to go cuz the flying back and forth is good, nice and relaxing for just doing kind of I can do it off camera and just fly. This thing has a, a a large jump rate too and it has a lot of capacity in uh cargo cuz it's obviously a transporter. And we also have the contacts. We can look down at the, ah, uh, yes, 22K in bond. And that's for the Alliance, I believe, right? Uh, huh. Okay, yeah, it was the Alliance. I guess it hasn't updated yet. And yeah, there it went. Okay, cool. So I redeemed that. If I go back, now we can go to the commodities market. Oh, I wanted to go outfitting again. Uh, I wanted to try seeing if they had a... An upgraded cargo rack. Cause that's I can get the four, right? Because that's a class two, and this is class one. Cargo rack capacity four. Yes, we can upgrade. Confirm. So we're we're getting a little bit more. Perfect. Uh huh. Right. Confirm. Okay, so we we've now upgraded our capacity a little. Uh, I wanted to check this one because it is a two. I might be able to get it up to 8 or 6 or something. 8. I know it's a little more money. But we can now haul a little bit more. Awesome. So now we have a capacity of, what, 8, 16? If we dump this, we could get another 8. That'd be 24. <sighs> we didn't run into anyone before. Oh, man. 24, so we hauled, what, a total of 7 here? 6 here? We could have gotten more. We could have just bought some other things. There weren't any. Uh, I could have logged in and logged out. Uh, to me, that's kind of cheaty to do. Um, let's let's stay with this for a little bit. We have a couple more locations to jump to. There's like 6 or 7 different systems we can jump to and buy additional things. So we're going to get this one egg. It's a leathery egg. Fossilized Xeno ovum. Scientists were quickly able to show that the eggs traded are actually a product of a team of highly talented prop designers. For some collectors, owning one of these eggs is their top priority. With all priority. Okay. <laughs> yep. 
So we have one egg. We're gonna buy that. Really expensive, 24k. We blow up. Mmm, we lose it. And we're gonna get rid of that. Uh, the other, the next area is Lave. We go to, they're all really close too, I think. But if I just, oh, there's a lot here. Uh, galaxy map. Let's go to the galaxy map. And we could be doing this as we're getting out of here. There's Lave, it's right next door. Good. So there's a couple of these here. Uh, we need Lave, we need Lis this one, Listy, uh, Daiso, is that one there? And, ooh, this one? And then, Orari, this one here. So all of them are here, we're gonna pick up a bunch and then we're gonna go back. Uh, we're gonna do the, the shopping in this system, or the, the local systems, and we're gonna go from that. I should have done that as, as I was leaving. There's not much else I can do as we're going through contacts. I really want to get rid of this uh, Empire Bounty. Because I 130,000 is a lot of pesos for, for Little Blitz. Okay. Let's do it. It's just one jump away. And we're going to Lave Station. And they have Lavian, Brown, <laughs> Lavian Brandy. I was going to say Lavian Brownies. I had a brownie tonight. Actually, a couple. Oh, hello! That guy out here scared me. That one. Oh, there's actually a player here. The the box down here. You look right down here. There's a little box. The outline is an actual player. Uh, hopefully, they don't take me out because that would be not fun. That would be negative fun, sir. Negative fun. What's that movie? Remember the Titans? Who is your daddy? You are my daddy, sir. What is fun? Weird movie. We watched that so many times in high school. Okay, hurry up. Mask locked. So, uh, let's talk a little bit about last episode. <laughs> so, I, I wanted to try something different. A lot of you liked it. A lot of you didn't like it. And that's kind of what I wanted to do, is get a little polarizing opinions on it. I What I should have done... So, last episode, for those of you who have not watched, is I... Instead of like cutting out a bunch of it, I just smushed it all down into one into four times faster Make everything faster. So it was like click 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 going through what I should have done was made like one or two jumps maybe interesting ones and Cut the rest out and put in music to that time. So it made it look like I was actually traveling to those different points um, I kind of cut it up with talking doing different things as the, the server was shutting down but I should have added some ambiance to it, some music in the background. The the individual game sound didn't turn out as right. No, hi. So we need to go to the lave station here. Okay, that scared me. Um, yeah, but I, I should have I should have changed it up rather than doing it one solid thing. And you know, I'm this game is is kind of new to me. Hey, we, we're done with the gas station. Um, and trying to trying to do, I've not really done a Let's Play series in a game like this before. So, uh, I am learning as I'm going. This is taking a long time to get here because I don't have my throttle all the way up. You know, we're not accelerating and we're in the planet's gravity. But in the future, what I think I'm gonna do, it like on the way back, on the way back to uh, 39 Tari, what I'm gonna do is um, basically cut out like half of it and then add in some music so a lot of you guys who do like the the travel time um, you know it's not really the the destination it's more of the journey to put it like Firefly would say it and it's kind of telling the story as we go but then again watching 20 minutes of doing nothing but traveling can get pretty boring so uh, I'll try to make it a little more interesting in the future it's just it's difficult for me because I'm I'm new. I'm a terrible editor on videos too. I have no video editing background, so I'm just trying to have fun with it and share my story with you guys. But I know I need to make it interesting too, so we'll do the best we can on the future, and hopefully we'll make it interesting. There's Planet Lave right there. There's a spaceship on it too. So, after I take all this stuff back, my goal is to get the Viper. And I want to put the interdiction module on the Viper. And the limpet, limpet thing to take out the cargo. To steal cargo. 
I think that'd be kind of neat to do. Uh, also like to play around with generally uh, wars that are going on. Not right now because I'm not, well I guess I'm sort of geared. I could strip this thing down and make it a lot faster. We already have a, a better FSD, but we'll have to see. So, yeah, we might, we actually might uh, need to cut some of these longer journeys out on this one too, as long as they don't get interdicted. That's kind of one of the reasons too that I did it is I was scared about getting interdicted and I didn't have, uh, really the, oh great, oh nice. <laughs> so you guys said if I click on it, there's an arrow. See the arrows down on the map and below that you can see actually which direction the entrance is. That's good. There's other players here. Commander Chris QT. He's clean. And I bet he's loaded with gear, because this is one of the most known trading trading things in this in the galaxy. Trading routes. Okay, let's contact. Request docking. Go on down. There's a couple commanders here. Oh boy. It's not good. I don't want to be, I don't want to be interdicted by a commander. I feel comfortable getting away with, getting away from the other ones. Hi. That was another player, I think. So we're at 14, which is that one. Sort down their landing gear. And we'll try to get this landing going a little better. Go in until the little circle is in the back. And I can go straight down. Forward and down a little more. Ha! Ah, that was pretty good. Decent. Starport services. We'll see if they have any of their wonderful brandy here. Commodities. Maybe. Ah, there we go. Those are leathery eggs. And the brandy. Good, they have six of it. Nice, so we're up to seven of 16. Do they have anything else? They don't. All right. Uh, we don't need the outfitting. Hit some fuel quick, because it was two. And we could do some of these things too, because there's, there's fun things. Traffic report. So there's a lot of asps that have come in. A couple anacondas. Probably a lot of these are players right here. <laughs> That's cool. Oh, uh, shoot. Services. Contacts. This one? No? I thought this... Oh, this is Alliance Ground. I thought this was Empire. Huh. Alright. Next up, let's uh, launch. I'm gonna turn us around. Next up, we need to go to Listi. Navigation. That should be one of the closer ones. This one right here. Okay. That was quick. Let's get out of here. Oh, there's like four or five commanders here. All of those black box or the square boxes. The hollow ones. Commanders. That's cool. Hopefully we want to get scanned. Because they can see what we have for gear. We're not really worth that much right now, though. Uh, probably look in the right direction. That would help out. So, Listy. This is the George, Luke and George Lucas station. They have Azure Milk and Evil Juice. I guess that's what they named it. Alright, we're making it here soon enough to <laughs> disengage. We'll go on the underside of it. Oh, hello. Alright, click that bad boy, see where we need to go. It's like it's on the top. Look at that. Well, is it is there a top? Is there an up and down in space? It's an interesting question. I hadn't even thought of that. Because like that's the top. But now it's the bottom. Huh, amazing. Crazy how that works. Contacts. George Lucas. Request docking. Independent Lasati. This is 
independent dudes. Okay, we're at number six. Hello. Yeah, it'd be so much fun to... Oh, it'd be so much fun to follow one of these guys and see what they did. Wait for him to get far enough away and then interdict him. There's another one on the left there. He was a friend, or a human too. Six is one of the lower ones, isn't it? That six? There it is. Scoop on down. I am way too far away. Got it. Starborn Services. Now I think this was a, a alliance thing. I'm gonna check the contacts just to make sure. Still can't get any. Nope. Yeah, independent alliance. Okay, so that's fine. And they have some as your milk. Good. Four more. I like that. And they should have some other stuff. Oh, great. Oh, good. Yeah, the evil juice. Okay. So that is everything. Hmm. That's a full load. Well, what do I do now? I don't have music picked out yet. I can't quite, can't quite go. Can I, should we? There's like two more stops here too. Daiso that has Daiso Makorn. Oh, there's three more stops. I don't have enough for them. Hmm. So we could go, I should check. Okay, my joystick stopped working. Um, the Daiso right here, and then Starborn Services, and we can go to Outfitting. Can I get rid of my shields? <laughs> this might be really, really dumb. If they have one, capacity four. Do they have the next higher one? They do. Oh boy. We're risking it. <laughs> we made money on the deal though. Okay, so I've got 24 space now. Uh, what was the commodities market? So cargo, they don't have any more. And the evil juice, they're out of. So we can exit out of here. We can exit and then we can go to Daiso. Let's launch up. This might be a really, really dumb idea. Because now I'm just a sitting quacker. So I wanted to check out... Is it green? Which are... Which are which color? Independent Alliance Federation. I don't see where the feds are. Wait. Empire is purple. Where in the dump is... What's red then? Oh, whatever. Let's exit out of here. I already have my location. I just need to go. Okay, and out. Oop, down, 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 down. I've turned. I returned our space RV into a hauler. It's like a dilapidated semi truck now. Okay, up we go. No fire zone has been left. There is Daiso up ahead. We can fit in four more things here as soon as we're no longer mass locked. Engines are all the way up. Come on, buddy. Let me go. Let me go. There it is. Shift now port for some corn. That's what we're going to see. Okay, shift now port. Another close one. Head over to this. No one's here. That's good news. So one thing you can actually do if you wanted, uh, you can do these trade routes like I'm doing, but you can play it in solo play and not open play. I could go and drop out of the servers and just play solo and be like no risk and all reward. Kind of. I mean, you can definitely play that way, but 
It's it's kind of fun having the risk of another player. You don't know they're so... An NPC is not going to do much to you, but another player, you have no clue what it's going to do. And I just did this again. Come on. Let's hit that... Hit the planet. Ah, oh, didn't quite work. I could have dropped out immediately. There's another player here. Oh, it's so far away now. Nope, that's uh, that beacon. Here. That's not so bad. I thought I had it in auto auto cruise mode. There is the auto docking mechanism too. I think that's so weird. <laughs> you can actually dock. It well, it does blow you up a lot of times too. You can press the button and it'll automatically dock you into the station or you put down your landing gear, I think it is, and it automatically will take you into your drive hole parking spot in the parking deck. So we have four, eight more, eight more, wow, eight more. We're going to be worth a lot of money when we get back. Then we're going to have this giant bounty from the Empire too that I can't figure out how to sell. And then we get to the distance, and we're good. And we're at shift now port. <sighs> Let's do it. Ooh, we're on the good side. I like it. Eight, seven. Okay, we can go ahead and go to our contacts and request docking. Let's see what we got. Perfect. Right into the space station. I could I could boost again. I like to live dangerously. Live fast and die dangerously. Not with all this cargo though. It's be worth a ton when we get there. Okay, 20. Oh, look at this. Hi. Nice of you to drop by. Landing gear deployed. Perfect. Down we go. Almost. Oh, you're kidding me. I actually damaged myself because I didn't have a shield. Oh, oh. Oopsies. <laughs> That was that was good. That was a good one. I'm gonna repair. Earn some of our m money. Refuel. Let's go to the commodities market, and we get what did they have? Decima corn. Oh, they have twelve. That's great. Twenty-four, twenty-four. Ha <laughs> ha. Man, you know there's there's two more stations. Uh, you uh, guest installation at Yuza, and then. Or a very or something like that. There's nothing else down there. <sighs> we could make it. We could go back now. I don't think. I'm gonna check contacts again just in case. I don't think this will work though. And then the black market. Obviously, we don't have anything to sell there. So now the goal is to go back to 39 Tauri and adventure. Um, hmm. How far away is that again? Should be pretty far. Man. Wish I could... Let's actually look for a little bit in the galaxy map. Some of you guys haven't seen too much of this, I know. Navigation. Economic routes, we need fastest route. Route and route, did I say that right? Uh, and if we only look for Empire. You can see if there's anything actually around us. It's Empire. I think Empires are up and down. Hmm. Well, there's some down here. Way down. Yeah, all these little guys. You could actually make it to that one. Uh, let's look at navigation to 39. Yeah, it's over this way. And he's got to load for a little bit, right? 160 light years away. Let's go there. We're going to select that destination, and we're going to go back. So far, so we can look down, and I'd like to plan my my adventure to it. There's that's our system right there. That's where we live. Ooh, that one. Fastest route. We could go there.
made it to our system, we need to find a hub. Like that one. And see what we can do. This is a really close one. A hub. Oh yeah, hubba hubba. We're gonna get all sorts of good stuff here. Um, probably just selling our selling our bounty because this is Empire space. We have 137,000 in Empire money. I should really be paying attention to where I'm driving. This corkscrew up. Whoa, where'd it go? Sometimes it freezes weird and you don't know where you're going anymore. There's a lot of ships around here. An Imperial Clipper? I hope that's a player, because that'd be awesome. I don't think it is, though. So we're making it to this hub. Yeah, I don't see any players on the map down below. Three? Almost there. It's six seconds away, but it's more than six seconds away. That's the other thing I need to work on, is my drifting procedure. I get too impatient. I just zoom right to it and then pass it and then have to come back to it the other way and then pass it again. What I should do is just drop out and take the damage. That's that's what I need to do. No, I'm not doing that. Okay, the hub. I hope... I, you know, I didn't even check. Okay, it is Empire. Cormac hub is Empire controlled, so we should be able to get the stuff here. Wow. Okay, let's go up top here. And it's nine away. Gonna boost up and around because I'm impatient. And watch me explode again. That still didn't take us very far. Wow. Let's request docking. Docking request. Wrong. Thank you. Here we go, right into the old shrinkter, the space shrinkter. Let's get inside, we're at 35 or 6? 36. I kind of wish you could know, I wonder if it is, if everyone's random, that you could just get into it. Or if it's uh, different in each case. I ain't got nothing. I ain't got nothing illegal in your place. I'm all clear, Commander. I know, I know, brother. Okay, 36 it is. Let's drop down that landing gear. Go in for the old landing. landing gear deployed. And make payday. Okay, down, and then... Kind of just ease on in. Ease on down. Kind of just ease on backwards. A little bit. And then we can ease on down. And then we can ease on forward just a hair. And then we can come over, and then, oh yeah, yeah, check this out. Making it down. Ha! Ha! That feels good. Feels good. Lighten up the shoulders a little bit, hit a little refueling. Go to the... Come on, nope. Uh... Contacts. Yes. Yahoo! Hey day good deal well guys that's gonna do it for this video i hope you've enjoyed keep your stick on the ice we'll catch you next time